Hi everyone, Rubber Mold Man here with a quick video on how to paint very simple but very effective eyes on statuary. Uh, this is a method I came up with years ago. You can do much more detail in eyes than what I'm going to show you in this video, but this is uh, what I came up with because I wanted something that would work on almost all statuary. Uh, here we're going to be using a large pelican, but this uh, basic uh, simple eye uh, painting technique I would say works on probably 80-85% of the different statues out there. And keep in mind that this eye will work on all types of uh, animal statues, like cats of course in real life have uh, uh, kind of slits for eyes. That does not look right when you try to paint that on statuaries, at least most of the time. Uh, most people will accept a simple kind of human style eye on just about any animal, and that's what uh, I'm going to show you here. Um, but uh, just keep that in mind because if you try to paint a realistic eye on most animals it just does not seem to work right where this uh, very simple eye works most of the time and again you can add your own flair to it or that my whole uh, plan is coming up with quick and simple ways to finish statuary so as you can see here uh, this statue like most has the little sculpt of the eye there I just paint that all with the white latex paint to start with and I don't worry about if if it's a super good coat, as long as it's white, uh, such as you see here. Uh, now, I'm not going to actually paint on camera here because I'm trying to hold the phone here that I'm recording with, but I have them in uh, each step here. Next step, you choose what color you want the eye to be. Now, these are pelicans, so I went with kind of a uh, orange finish, but, uh, you know, depending on the animal or the statue, you can do blue or brown or green. It's really up to you. Uh, whatever you think looks right. But basically you're just doing a circle on the white and you do the circle uh, for front facing statues you want the circles uh, to both be on the same side meaning like on a human type statue where the both eyes are on the front uh, you don't want to mirror the eyes or else you get a cross eye effect. On animals like this pelican though where there's an eye on each side of the head uh, you can mirror them. So in this case, I put the uh, circle kind of to the front of the eye. So you just do that on each side there. So then the next step, you put the pupil in. Again, just a simple circle. And again, just kind of do it a little bit to the uh, side that you put uh, the color of the eye, the iris. Uh, so you do that. Now you got three different colors there making the eye, but yet it's super easy. And then to finish it, all you do, and you don't even need to use the uh, end of the brush, or the uh, bristles on the brush. You can actually just use the uh, tip of the handle sometimes and dip it in and just put a little dot. And then for a little extra flare, you could even go and put a little slash like that. I don't always do that, but just depending on the piece, if the eye is big enough, you can do that. It's supposed to be kind of like a glare of light. And as you can see real close here, you can see that it's not super detailed. It's a little smudgy in that. I mean, this is concrete. It's rough, uh, porous and that paint dries out here in the sun as I'm painting you know it's a hot day today um, so from uh, a close-up view you can see real close it's not that detailed right but let's go ahead and pan out a bit and show you what we got going here there it is on my work table you step back a bit and that is a beautiful looking statue nice large pelican statue and that eye just really brings it all together and again Back up close, nothing to it at all. Anybody can do that, just give it a little practice. And remember, if you mess up, just paint over it with the white again and try again. Nothing wrong with that. So I hope that uh, gives you uh, some ideas on uh, ways to finish statuary. And as you can see, a simple paint finish goes uh, a long way in making a beautiful statue. These statues, unpainted, would probably sell for $40, $50. Painted, I get over $100 for that statue, just from doing a nice uh, paint finish like that. Keep in mind, folks, if you want more ideas uh, for statuary, check out my website, rubbermoldman.com. Uh, I'm also on Facebook at Rubber Mold Man, and I hope to have more videos soon. Thank you, and have a great day.